Today we have another battle with my Seeking Team. Um, I don't get to show Love Disc in this battle. I know some of you are eager to see Love Disc, but I haven't just had a, haven't had a good opportunity to use it yet. So, I start with the um, Thunder. Seeking gets a Lightning Rod boost, and uh, they proceed to go for an Energy Ball from their Chandler. And thankfully, I have Rinder Bro, so it holds the damage. So, Seeking doesn't fake this turn because they actually gang up on it. I mean, come on, there's, there's no need to gang up on a Seeking. Uh, of all Pokemon, uh, anyway, um, I go for the Soak, which is a, uh, a, a mistake. But then I take advantage of that by then going for the Thunder on the Drapion, because now Drapion is Water type thanks to Soak. Um, well, normally Drapion is only weak from the ground, and Dr Drapion is actually surprisingly bulky. And uh, <coughs> the Chandler goes for the Energy Ball, which I would say does about a quarter. And then I get Leftovers Recovery, which is. Yeah, most of the colors have leftovers, but this one actually has Swift Rim rather than uh, Rain Dash. So I proceed to go for the, for the Rain Dance, and by the way, I've got Damp Proc. If you're wondering, and they go for the Bullied Snam, which does, uh, I would say, about a third, and it gets the prices, which is unfortunate. And uh, they go for Flame Flora, which does quite a bit. Um, well, actually, that's critical. Oh, uh, yeah, because the rain's up, so it would have done less. So I go for the Home Claws, and by the way, my little kind of special attacker has got um, a Hydro Pump in addition to the Brick Break. Uh, you don't get to see its last move in this battle. And uh, Hydro Pump proceeds to one hit KO, Chandler. Thankfully, it doesn't have a Focus Sash. Uh, I think it would have one hit carried it anyway, even without the rain, because its defences aren't that brilliant. And I think it's another body slam, I believe. And uh, I go to the Thunder, does a huge chunk on Mill Tank, which is like Drapion, surprisingly bulky, and gets Paralysis, and then I get Leftovers Recovery in there. Mill Tank also has Leftovers. And now they go for the Cacturn, and uh, I go for the Brick Break, and Brick Break makes Mill Tank, and now they go for um, Retaliate, which I wasn't expecting, and that means. Since they had Pokemon fainted, there's double damage this turn, which is actually a good move on their part. Um, I wouldn't have predicted that. Anyway, uh, I go for the Hidden Power, which I believe is Dragon, and then uh, I go for the Brick Break to finish things off. And uh, yeah, my narration is probably rubbish, but I hope you enjoyed the battle, and I'll get more battles with the team soon.